Hey everybody, it's Alabama Boss. Well, Thanksgiving around the corner, a lot of y'all is gonna be deep frying the yard bird, but I'm gonna suggest you try something different. And today, we're gonna show you how to deep fry a nine pound ribeye. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and get it put on my little Duma Flotcha here. We're gonna mount it upright. You're gonna take a knife, I'm gonna run it a long way through. Okay, before I season this ribeye up, I'm gonna show you a little trick on how to figure out how much oil you need to put in your pot so you don't burn the place down. What you do is you fill it up with water, put whatever you're cooking down in here. In this case, it's a ribeye. Make sure it covers the top by about a half inch to an inch in water. Then take it back out. And then you just want to take a little Sharpie or something and make a mark where you want to bring your field line to. And that's how much oil you're going to need to cook a nine pound ribeye or whatever you may be cooking. We're going to be using peanut oil to deep fry this. We got our mark, that way we don't waste no oil because this stuff is not cheap. Oh, the great sound of nice thick oil. Now, I'll let that be heating up to 350. I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing rubbed down and injected. You can use whatever kind of rub you want to on this. It doesn't matter, it's up to you. If you got a rub you like, put it on there. Salt and pepper is probably just fine. All right, this ribeye's got plenty of fat on it, but we're gonna put a little more butter on the inside. Quite a few of us out there has been marinated from the inside. It's a good thing I don't work in a doctor's office. I probably wouldn't make it very long. God <laughs> son of a bitch. <laughs> My brand new coat. All right, we got our outside seasoned up. We got the inside injected. It's time to check the oil with our thermometer. We got our oil up to about 350. It's time to put this rib roast in the deep fryer. What we're gonna do is gonna use our meat hook we got right here so we don't get no splash on us. We'll take it over and ease her in. Okay, we want to cook this thing about three minutes a pound. We got a nine pound rib roast, so we're gonna cook it about 30 minutes. All right, this thing's been in there about 30 minutes. Check the internal temperature on it. We got it up to about medium rare. That's where you want a steak, people. Medium rare. Don't go no further than that. Woo oh yeah. All right, now we're gonna wrap this thing up good and tight. You wanna keep it wrapped up tight. Do not cut on it. Let them juices flow throughout the whole roast. All right, we put in the work. We've let it set for 30 minutes wrapped up. Let's cut into this thing, see what we got. Ooh, it's looking good. The outside of this thing is a nice crunch, real juicy ribeye in the middle. Try it out and see how it is. You will slap your mama, your grandmama, your granddaddy, everybody is getting slapped. After you do this one time, you're gonna rethink grilling. There you have it, deep fried rib. You got any neat cooking tips for us, put them in the comments below. And be sure to check out Rated Red on our Snapchat Discover channel. I'm Alabama Boss. Y'all have a good one.